three, three, two, two, one, one. Got a blast. What is going on my people? How is everybody doing and how is everybody feeling in today? Welcome back to another video and in today's video I'm gonna be showing you all how to make the one and only AK-47 Andre Kirilenko, my people. I am a fan of Andre Kirilenko. This man, when he was on the Jazz, I'm surprised that this Jazz team didn't go far in the playoffs. They had Boozer, they had Dan Williams, AK-47, they had um... I forgot the center. He was like a stretch big who could shoot the three. Let me see if he's actually on here right now. Maybe. Okay, I don't even think he's in the game. But yeah, he used to be dominant. Okay, from AK-47, Carlos Boozer, and then Dan Williams. I mean, that this team was crazy. And then, like I said, the center, who I can't think of his name, but he could shoot the three too. So they had a squad, but they just couldn't get the squad to go far into the playoffs, man. But... So we're going to check out this build. So look at this, power forward 6'9", 235 pounds, 7 foot wingspan. Um, as you can see, 88 driving layup. This is going to be incredible if you ask me, because what you're going to understand is that 88 gives you all of the layup packages. That's what you want. Standing dunk is a 55, so that's going to be insane as well. Keep that in mind. That's going to be a very good build to, to make and have. Then you get the driving dunk of a 67. You don't need a crazy dunk in this year just to make dunks. You can get a driving dunk of like 50, 55 and still get some good dunk packages, you know? Um, so that's gonna be good. The inside is really good. Now the shooting, yes, AK-47, man. Great shooting. Sm uh, he was a he played small forward, but you see they have him as a power forward, but he was really the small forward because Boozer was power forward at the time, but 88 mid-range with an 82 three-point shot. So you already know the shooting is gonna be there for you. And the free throw, take this build to the rack and you can go crazy, all right? 82 in the post control, as you can see right here. So this is gonna be nice. So you're gonna be able to play in the post, shoot the three, shoot the midi. So that inside out type of game is gonna be there for you. Now, we're looking at the pass accuracy. Pass accuracy of a 78, ball handling 82, speed with the ball 72, that's it, right? So, you might be able to be a, not a secondary, or maybe a third uh, ball handler, you know what I mean? Because, you know, this is really, it's cool, but it's decent. All right, now we're looking at the defense. We know AK-47 had great defense. So look at that, still at an 88, 72 uh, perimeter, 80 interior. That block is a 91. Why not just go 92 for anchor? Come on, 2K, just, just go 92. So that's gonna be nice. And then the rebounding is also going to be there. Okay, so this is gonna be an insane build right here. Oh man, 6'9", and just going crazy, right? Now we're looking at the physicals. As you can see, 78 speed, 76 acceleration, 70 strength, 78, then 90 stamina. So this build is looking real crazy. This is like a great lockdown build. Uh, you might be able to play, hold on, let me see the physicals again. I mean, the defense, you might be able to play one through five. Something like, yeah, you should be able to play one through five. You know what I mean? Uh, because like I said, this, this right here is what makes this build so special. The way that this looks is just insane, my people. You cannot go wrong with this, all right? Let's make AK-47 Andre Kurlinko. All right, my people. So me and the mob play, but as you can see, first and last name, first and last name, Andre Kurlinko. Right hand jersey number is I forgot. I'm always why do I keep forgetting these jersey numbers? It's crazy. All right, so first things first. What you want to do is we're going to power forward, okay? Once you go to power forward, you want to stay at 6'9", and then uh, you want to go to a... Hold on, I got to find my notes. Okay, so 6'9", 235 on the weight, and then you want to go 7 foot on the wingspan. So this is what we're rocking with right here. Now, my favorite part is making this build. So let's go right into making this build close shot at a 71 i speak highly of a 71 for most builds because of that fast twitch and i believe that every build to have a little bit of a uh, close shot from one through five in any position that's how i feel shot is important it's not just about post hooks and i've, I've shown that 85 on the driving dunk we get a lot of great uh layer packages we get a lot of great badges as you can see this is unbelievable seeing this on the right hand side it's extraordinary okay now for the driving dunk we're gonna go 67 he didn't have a high driving dunk we're just gonna go 67 right here and then the standing dunk we're going 55 you will be able to get standing dunks with this post control i decided to go 77 on the post control okay so this is everything for the finishing 
as you can see we get some great badges we get great badges here this is going to help us out a lot to be able to score in the paint that layup is going to be nice it's going to be a lot of good stuff with this bit all right 84 on the mid-range shot my people okay 84 84 midi magician dead eye that's what we want 84 also gives us some great uh um jump shot animations that we would want to get 82 on the three-point shot okay that claymore on gold is gonna be extraordinary that's what we want free throw as you can see we're going 80 on the free throw so not only is this a park build but this is a rec build my people this is gonna be a great build for anybody that wants to play on a park on a rec you're gonna be able to do some good things the shooting alone is gonna be top tier okay pass accuracy we're going 77 with this okay 77 is nice because that needle threader at 77 is going to be extraordinary okay now for the ball handling we are going 80 that is the max 80 is going to be nice and we also get unpluckable on silver so you're going to be able to dribble and then we're only going 70 on the speed with the ball okay we're not going to be able to get that 75 but that's all right my people because this build is still great at what it's going to be able to do defense okay we're going 74 on the interior defense that's going to be great the perimeter we're going 71 as you can see right here to get that challenger that's very important to me and then we are going with that 81 still you had a high still but we're just going to go 81 for that interceptor on silver okay the block we're going to have block we're going to go with an 87 so we can get that silver anchor so this build is going to be nice man it's going to be a solid Andre Karolinko build 60 60 on the um the rebound he had higher rebounding but I just decided to just go 60 60 here all right so this is what we're gonna rock with now for the speed we're going 77 which is the max we're going 67 for the acceleration which is the max the strength we are going to a 70 because that's what he had by going 70 this is awesome 70 gives you post lock now back down punisher and box out beast so that is incredible now we're going 75 for the vert uh we're not going to get contact dunks but 75 gives us a lot of nice uh badges that we would want for andre Karolinko build and then the rest we're going to 93 on the stamina so you can see how good this build is going to be this is a great two-way balance type of build you're going to be able to get great passes you're going to be able to handle the ball block shots get steals play great defense um it would have been cool probably at least get uh you know clamps on bronze that would have been kind of cool but it is what it is uh speed is there the shooting is there the post is there and you're going to be able to finish which is going to be great when it comes to this build all right so once you do that you put all these attributes in like i did but you're going to see number one shades you're going to get andre Karolinko. this is a great build to me okay this is a great build especially because we are limited this year to what we can do i wish it said two-way but it's all good um to what we can do this year all right so y'all let me know what i thought about this build just let me know what you would have done differently and until next time much love